By the end of this video, you'll know all about what aluminum profiles are and why they are the backbone of any industrial facility. Hello, my name is Brian Sample, and today we are talking about what aluminum profiles are, their uses and applications, and some options you have for sourcing them. An aluminum profile in the simplest terms is a shape of metal used to build a variety of structures in nearly all manufacturing facilities. Think of it like Legos. With a variety of shapes and sizes, they can be put together in nearly endless combinations to create anything from carts to robotic components and everything in between. Aluminum profiles start with aluminum blanks being heated to extremely high temperatures and then being forced through a series of dyes to form different sizes and shapes. This process, also known as the extrusion process, ultimately gives us an aluminum profile's final form. For any type of shape or structure you're looking to create, you will most likely be able to use aluminum profiles to complete your build. That's just how versatile this building material really is. Because of the extrusion process, you'll have a large variety of shapes and sizes available to you, which can help your builds come to life. Things I've seen built with these profiles include carts, workstations, server racks, 3D printers, conveyor systems, and so much more. Most important of all, since the profiles go through such high temperatures during their manufacturing process, they are incredibly durable. This gives you a way to build your structure simultaneously quickly and securely. After hearing all of that, you're probably wondering, where can I get these aluminum profiles from for my next project? Don't worry, I got you covered. Some reputable companies include MK North America, 8020, T-Slots, and Item. While you can order from any of these companies directly, another option you have is contacting your local distributors for assistance. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to Automation Nation. Have any questions? Drop them in the comments below and we'll do our best to answer them for you. See you next time.